Hello, hello. Uh, Kevin Leeds Harmonica here again. Um, you know the backing tracks that I've been using um, for this series on YouTube uh, from an account called MCCD Sessions. Um, incredible backing tracks, and there's loads of them. Um, one of my, one of the guys that I'm working with, uh, hi Paul, said to me the other day, do you know who that guy is? Have you ever, who's, who's done all those tracks? I've got no idea, I just found it on YouTube. So he suggested I check him out, and lo and behold, I've gone on and found his uh, website. I had to whack it through Google Translate, because it's in um, uh, uh, French or, or Swedish or something. Anyway, um, this is this guy's had an incredible life. He um, he fled the Khmer Rouge in Cambodia and um, had all sorts of horrible shit happen to him along the way. Lost family members and everything. Um, just horrible, terrible stuff. Anyway, long story short, he's pitched up in uh, Sweden eventually and which is where he discovered blues and now he not only is a phenomenal blues player but he's a teacher as well he plays harmonica piano uh guitar and sings like you wouldn't believe it. i'll link a um uh a video down in the description because it's where i pulled today's lick from um just absolutely astonishing and I guess it just goes to show you never really know who you're dealing with um, when you just start running into people online. Um, I mean, that guy's got some serious history. Um, and he's also um, involved in uh, charity work for back home. So I think he set up some sort of educational establishment back there and whatnot. And he runs blues clubs in Sweden. Uh, he teaches harmonica. Amazing. Anyway, I thought it was worth pointing that out um, because God bless him. Very, very cool. Um, so I've picked one of his links from uh, a little live video that, like I say, I'll link in the description. I'm on a D harp today. Um, here we go. Okay, so this lick is, um, it's a very earthy kind of um, early bluesy uh, Sunny Boy 1 kind of style. I'm probably not even playing it the same way, uh, exactly the same way twice there. So we've got the three blow, excuse me, three blow, 5-2 uh, split, not an octave, it sounds really, it sounds really filthy, and then the 6-3 octave, back to the 5-3, into a 4-draw bend, rising and letting a little bit of 5 in there, Back to your four draw bend, very quickly over three draw, and then twice on the two draw. Um, very, very cool lick. So you've got that <clears throat> real sort of bluesy wailing. We're, um, we're laying on the uh, that five draw, which is um, an F flat seventh, right? And I, uh, I'm on a D harmonica here, by the way. I always talk theory as if we're playing a C, so I, I think a five draws in it, a flat seventh anyway. Um, cool, so I've got um, one of his session, uh, one of his jam tracks here, and let's whack it on, it's an acoustic one, let's see if I can do this.
so many tiny little variations you can stick in here. So I'm really using that lick really as a shell here. I'm playing it very differently all the time. and so on and so forth. Um, I'm not convinced I've got the best possible backing track for this one, but anyway, um, very, very cool lick. I'm very pleased to know more about this guy because I was astonished. Anyway, um, I'll catch up with you later. Enjoy. Bye.